Yes, I'll speak to Nina about the upcoming reports for the Ministry. She's not here, but I'll speak to her. Thanks. Oh, hi, Terence. Uh, Janice. Yes. Hi, yes. How can I help? Nina's in the toilet, I think. Yeah. How are you, Terence? I'm fine. Better, actually. Have you heard from any of these students' parents? Well, they're the usual tiger mums, and who knows with what you hear from the online gossips. I'm just worried some students are affected. Yeah. Uh, what about kids like Matthew, Rajendra? Should I be concerned? Are your students facing difficulties? Uh, no, no, not at all. Just checking. Good. Glad everything is well. Yeah. Great. All right then. Mm -hmm. I heard the boys were caught, the ones that attacked Kairi Sun. Shame that has to go to this extent, isn't it? I don't know if I'm too old for this. All the fake news, media, online gossiping affecting our students' behavior. I think we're all getting a bit too old for this. I don't think so, no. Look at you. Still young and impressionable. From what I hear, our students love and adore you. I'm not perfect, Janice. Oh, nobody is. <laughs> but at least you don't cause any trouble. I see that you're helping out that Malaysian scholar. Whereas nowadays, we just read about teachers getting into trouble with students. And the worst I've heard is from our work school. You know, a teacher having a relationship with his female student. Thankfully, we don't get such things here. Yes, thankfully. I trust you, Nina. Keep it up. Our students need teachers like you. <laughs> Kim, you created an identity that everyone was in awe of. That shows something. Use that creativity, use that imagination. Use it to show what the real Kim is like. Stop hiding, stop hurting. Stop pushing everyone away from you and show them who you really are. Are you going to call my mother? I have to. I'm going to call her in three months. That should give you enough time. To do what? You're going for daily detention. And in addition to that, you will attend counselling. And in three months, I'm going to call your mother and tell her how proud I am of you. Of how you've blossomed into a terrific young woman. And if I don't? Counseling lesson number one. Believe that you can. <laughs>